Today, we we'll learn a little bit in the Vainik. I spoke everything yesterday, uh, two days ago, about the lead up to the Mukhi, to the guy. But what you do about Mukhid is Homer's and it's it, it spirit, I didn't get to. So, I just uh, prayed the kids, uh, according to what they do in Lubavitch. First of all, you should know that in the Rebbe Shulchan Aruch, in this chaylak over here, in the back over here, you see over here? In case you want to look at it, they say the Mechid of Hamas, with the uh, comments from the Shara Kaigo, and the uh, Zalman Shimon used to follow the uh, the Nusach over here, mostly. I mean, like, the, the guy gives a deposit on the Chomets. So how much should he give a deposit on the Chomets? In those days, $3 or three, whatever, Zlatas was a lot of money, Mr. So he used to write $3. Uh, uh, yeah. But uh, we write bigger amounts. It's a, because we, you know, we have a big ass You're sitting with a, a guy and telling him, that, you know, mm -hmm. you have millions of dollars of chametz and you're giving him three dollar deposit, you know. So, yeah, how many, uh, also, also, and the amount of people that have like Birkin yeah. sold for the amount of people you're selling for, yeah. a little bit larger numbers you have than Birkin had. Birkin had the mama, she didn't have the internet and the shluchim and the all the other things. He had Crown Heights people. Don't uh, forget the net. We used to make $200 a week. Over here, it, it explains a lot of the, <coughs> the details of, of the Mechidus Chomets. There's also, this is the Seid of Mechidus Chomets. And right after that, there's Seid the Mechidus Bahama Hamalakaris. If you have a Bechor, so you have to give it to a Kohen. So you sell it to a guy before. Uh. So then, before Pesach? No, before no, no, no. Pesach, before his birth. Before, yeah, yeah. before yeah. So there's also a page here with Say the Mechid of Hema and the Vakaris, you know. Okay. But uh, talking about the guy, just just uh, make the kids up. First of all, we, we have an order of Kabul. So for, first, before anything, the order of Kabul meets with the seller. And the other couple makes a Kenyan with the seller. How do you make the Kenyan? The other couple is being Meshabit himself. So the call is that the one who is kind of the Shibud has to give the beggar. We need, we need what you call Kalem Shokaina. He's a Shibud, he's kind of the Shibud. So the, the, uh, the Baobas, the Rav, that makes a Kenyan with the, uh, with the, with the, uh, with the Rav saying that he will be an order of Kabbalah for the guy. Then the Rav meets with the guy. No, no, I'm sorry, the, the, the order of Kabbalah meets with the guy. And the order of Kabbalah says for the guy, listen, the, um, the rabbi is going to ask you for a deposit. Hey, give me a deposit, I'll say $100. But if you say it's not enough, I mean, we're talking about a vast amount of money. Do you have anyone that will guarantee for you? So I want you to know I'll guarantee. Here is a star out of Kabul. And when the rabbi asks for Who's guarantee, guarantee? Give him this so paper. give him give the star. Paper. Now, I remember when Rabbi Mo'o, who I showed him, started the Chiris Chomets, I was already into it already. So I told him an important rule. Who was the out of Kabul? Uh, if you remember, the Rav Kablan was uh, Kazminsky. Kazminsky. Kazminsky yeah. <laughs> yeah. So I said, there's, first of all, you, you gotta give the, the guy, you gotta tell him to give, he's coming out of peso, he doesn't get anything. So if you wanna get money from him, so the way it's done is that the Rav Kablan Loan them. Lends money to the guy. And the guy has, has money. To be able to, he, he yeah. to pay some. 
So I said to him, it's important that two things, that the, the, the guy shouldn't, the guy makes money after Pesach. After you pay for the Chomet. But before Pesach, you want the, the guy have a statement. And I have for dinner. So the Arab Kabul gives him more Marshal, let's say, $200, okay? And the Rav asks him for a $100 deposit on the, on the food and a $50 deposit on the on the So the, 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 the guy went home with $50. Yeah. I said, but you have to, you have to give the Arakabin also something, because Minsk needed a few dollars. So if I'm gonna add more and tell him that, that tell the guy, give, give him $300, and tell him that the guy should give uh, yeah, and Melo the band black maker. That, that was a a private deal. The Arab Kabul could be such a person who doesn't have money himself. Huh? The Arab Kabul could be someone who doesn't have money himself. How could I guarantee a million dollars worth? Of, I don't even have a fifty cent in my pocket. The Arab Kabul doesn't have have no money. Why? Arab Kabul is just going to guarantee that he's going to get the people together to pay. Uh, you know, I, I want I once told the story with with the shul that nobody wanted to have the aliyah for the teichacha. Yeah. It's, it's a famous story, so there was a, that there was a guy that was, that they, he was masking, they, they paid him, but he'll come. Was come to the uh, the tight and he's out there, and they're waiting and waiting, and the last minute he runs in, the mamash goes, they say, where were you, hold on? He says, you think I can make a living for one teichacha? I got to go and let a shul also, <laughs> you know? I say, because so, Minsky was, was an art of carbon in two places, you know. <laughs> oh, I show him, he was a, he was a nice, nice guy. Um, so then later, the Rav meets with the, with, with, the, with the guy that's buying. And what we do is we try to make a number of kinyanum with him. We explain him everything that's in the shop, all the details, what we're selling him and that we told him that he has to give a deposit, he gives a deposit. Then you ask him if he has a guarantor, so he has, has the other carbon. And then you told him that um, <coughs> once you got the deposit, the, 50, the $100 or the $50, and you got the staff and the other carbon, so as far as you're concerned, you're paid in full already. You don't owe, you don't owe me anything. You owe money to the out of Kabul. You'll straighten out with him, not with me. I, I, was, paid, I was paid entirely. And How were you paid entirely? Because we got a guarantee for the money. And he got, got some the, money. The deposit. Oh, so you trust that the uh, that the Kajimitsu was going to come up with the rest of the money? That 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 he's going to have to give the the get Kabul the money from the guy. The rest of the money. Get, yeah. Well, the Kabul it won him by him, but. I have nothing to do. I already got my money. That's straight and shot. And we also told him that he has, it's not just for Pesach we're selling him, but he has three days after Pesach. What's the question three days after Pesach? The question is that uh, we want to give him a bigger market. Pesach, he can only sell it to Goyen. Three days after Pesach, you sell to Yidin. Mm -hmm. So now, so he has three days after Pesach, till he'll have to deal with the with the Arab Kabul on on on, the, on what he owes. The truth is, what we do when, when we buy back from the the guy after Pesach, so we say to him, we remind him, we, we, we say, you know, you want to have how did it go? Were you able to sell anything? Did you advertise? Did you meet any people? You know, you know going. To, so then we said, hey, you, you remember that you have another three days yet? Do you want so some maybe, you, that, maybe I, I could buy it now also. No. So the other couple buys it, buys it off from him now. And then he sells it back to the Rav. Okay. So we, we make a lot of Kenyan. One Kenyan we make... That's with, after that also three days? Yeah. One Kenyan we make with the, with the guy is a Kenyan uh, Kesef. Uh, the money, the Kenyan Kesef. 
Another kinyan we make with the goy is a kinyan star. We made a, a document. It's a star. A third kinyan that we make with the goy is, uh, is, is is actually that, that's not so much the dafka, but another a kinyan mashicha. Now, how could you make kinyan mashicha? So by giving him keys to the to the, the keys is, is considered like a kinyan mashicha. Yeah. Then we make with the guy a king in Agav. Because being that he's renting the places, so Agav, the places Kaka. which is Kaka, so he's kind of the, the, uh, the metal point of the king in Agav. Then we make with the guy a king in How do you make a king in You say to the guy, do you maybe have a, a knife on you? Yeah, every you go usually has a knife. So he gives you the knife, and you pick it up, and you give it back. So it's a kinyan chalitim. So you have already... A kinyan suda can't make. Chalitim is a kinyan suda. Chalitim you could make. Yeah. No, but however, however, there's a, there's a shayla, if you could make a kinyan chalitim with a guy. And that's why Dr. Rebbe in the Shtar didn't write kinyan chalitim. I wrote Kenyan Agav, and there's a shadow of Kenya you can make with a guy. But, uh, so he writes because there's dais about that, and the matter so between the two of them, between Khalid and Agav, you know, you have another Kenyan. So that that's the, all the Kenyan and that. The Castle of Star, particularly. Castle of Star. Why don't we have the Then we also on? have a handshake. A handshake in, in business. Key is Kaf. Key is is a Kenyan. In Shulchan Aruch, in Fan Eichet, what they called a Kenyan Satimta, where they, they used to have even a Kenyan, like a, a, a cup uh, in the foot. The, 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 so, Minigar Sachem. So, we do Key is Kaf. You shake hands with the guy, and somewhere between this, they have. And we make up with the guy that, in case any of these Kenyan was not good, each Kenyan should be considered individually, not not collectively. Because then otherwise it cancels Kenyan, them all out. Not at all, <laughs> but each one is individual. That's how the, 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 the say that is. Comes after, oh, oh yeah, another thing we do is, we give him, to make, when he's selling him the Chomets, so you're telling him we give him a discount because there may be certain taxes he may have to pay or something on the comment. And we also give him a, a, an additional discount, let's say, of $100. What's shutting that? Because the guy could ask a question. What do I got to buy from you? If I want to go into business, I can go to any wholesale and buy. So we tell him that we'll give you a discount of $100 lower than, 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 the, than the lowest wholesale price. But so you have, then later comes after Pesach. So we meet, we meet with the with, right. with the guy, the guy in the carbon, and he says to Mose, you remember, you gave a hundred dollars for for the chametz a deposit. You gave fifty dollars a deposit for the mekaymus. We promised you $100, a guaranteed discount. So, so you already have $250 in it. What would be if, if I'll give you $300? Will you be happy to sell it to me? So I said, yeah. So the guy walked away with $300. With $300. That, that's a... This is a stupid guy. A good guy who understands what is the value will ask for more money. They had smart guy over there too, and they were good. Mm-hmm. For a few years, they had the Shabbos guy. He was reading that contract and thought he was buying a building in Manhattan. Yeah, yeah. Remember him? Yeah. He read that contract everywhere. He knew he was a businessman. No. He owned. Yeah. He, he, got, you know, got junk. Yeah. He owned that company. He, he took. He took notes. He knew. When junk. he came the next year, he reminded us. Uh, yeah. Kenyan no, this, Kenyan that. He took he notes. Died, but, uh, he, but then yeah. later, I don't know something. Happened. I think. Yeah. He was, I think he was killed or what? So let's look a little bit inside. This is this is a bit a little bit of an overview of, of the Mechidas Chomets. But we'll look over here. 
Okay, let's let, let's just look at it a little bit. Where are we looking? Kufi Dawid. I'm not going to go too much over it. Yisrael <laughs> That means like this year at a Pesach, Hanor of Chometz is still about uh, 11.45. So you have to sell before 11.45. Well, you have any Mechir of Chometz, Eitz or Odin, Kamoi Mitzvah, Zadoshim, Ulamoda. By some Mitzvah, it's like a Pesach, as a Segula, a practice, it's just a formality. El Tzorach, Sheyigme, Bedatai, and our sheet is that he holds it a mechira gemura. There's some that hold it a, a, a aroma, but they were matter the aroma because of by your by emotion. There's two different opinions. Is that a friend? Yeah, I think there's some cipher. For yimka bekor mina mechira aroi, you shouldn't sell it from now. Now he's talking over here about a person that knows what chametz he's selling. But that's not, we write that we will shots up the value. We don't know right now how much of it. He has to pay for 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 it. And he has to pay for it. And he has to pay for it. We had kach with kach, but you hey, I double a kachuch or trua. It shouldn't be just a joke. Al kedaga kedara hasaycherim mamish hachomet shu meichlo v'kachom. So should I hey be basis of Yisrael? No, I mean he went, he went, he went to places then. The Melus is not the normally the guy took the chumbis his house when, when it was. One on one. Right. So we'll but over here, you rent them in the place. It says, man, it's not, it's not anymore the house of the Yid. So he says, a chomet, shumach oivik chom, tzorach she lo yehei be beisah she yisrael, v'im oivik chom le keach as a chomet, so take beisah ma taif. It's a rather good. V'im yef she yik achei le beisah, he can't take it. It's then tzorach a hashka le yis achei, that she a chomet, munach boi. In the star, has to say who's but the, the, the name of the guy, Ubekamo, and for how much, Hiske Goyas Acheda. So we say we will give a deposit and we'll, uh, we'll, praise, we'll praise the places. Mishainai Kaka, Mishagav Kaka, Hikna Goy as a Hamas. That's why I said before about Kenya Agav. Uh, let's go further. The Yifrit as called a Chomas become a Mocholoi. We don't do that because we can't, so we write that uh, it, w- it will be appraised. You don't have to put the, the, the measurements of each thing that you have a few five, uh, five pounds, pounds, pounds of this, three pounds of this. The Yuchalukarak Kama called Mida, the Mida, which is the prices. The whole other cause of the star, you daber in a kind of gamba pet. In other words, that's what we do. We explain everything, the star, even though I have the star translated in English also. And at the end, I told the, the guy, here's an English translation of what I told you, and you could read it at your convenience. 
ויקבו ממנו ארובן, והשאר מויז יסקף אולו במלווה. This is the other way, not the Lubavitcher way. I would have explained yes last time. In other words, he's saying, take a deposit. I, the guy owes you a lot of money. So don't say that he owes you money for the sale. That's a problem. Say, you know, I consider it as though you paid me a full once you gave me a deposit. And consider the, the balance, a chayv, not for the comets. No, a chayv for between me and you. That means yiskaf ola b'milva. You should make it, like throw it on him as a milva, as a halva. And the Rebbe, of course, doesn't go with this system. V'yehei hako kosev b'shtar, v'gam yimsele as a mavteach min ha'chayda. So now, what we do is, we give him a few keys, and we say, these are some of the keys to the places, and if you'll need any keys to any other place, you'll tell us and we'll, we'll provide it. We're giving you some. Shehei muna, this the Rebbe doesn't agree. There was a mice at one time. They were came for, for Pesach. They came a gas to New York, uh, a Dayan from England. I forgot his name. Uh, he was a literature Dayan. And, and they were machabed him to, to speak up by, 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 by Kinnis Titus. And he gave a whole shit about this Indian, about Taivu and Dekelim. Yeah. And, uh, yeah. and, and, and we, the Rebbe Pascha is different. The Rebbe, first of all, we, we, we sell the, the Kalim with the Chomets, but you don't have to cash uh, them. Because the, the poil, the Rebbe goes with the sheet that sucked us off the whole time it was Mishus saw. Even though you sold it, but the whole time it was Mishus saw. So we don't, but this is the Chassam Seifer. So every place that Chomets is in your house, that area is sold to a guy. That area where, where the Chomets that you want to sell. Well, you're selling all the Chomets in your house. So the closet, the, the closet that it's hanging in, the pantry. Let's say, let's say in, in your basement you have a box of cookies, you didn't know you had a box of cookies yet. That's so, also sold. So he's paying, you, he's paying you to hold his box in your basement. In your basement. Yeah. You don't have to know your box is there, even if it's not there. No. Well, but you're selling all the chametz in. I'm going to go to the wherever you have chametz in my house. Because uh, uh, last year there was a story. I wasn't there, but they told the story last year. A guy who was in Pennsylvania, he was in New York for the first days, and he sold his chametz. Everything was good and fine. Then he was going to go for the second day to Pennsylvania, and he remembered that he has a bottle of vodka sitting on the middle of his dining room table. So he made a whole big deal. I said, "What's the big deal?" I, I heard about it now. I said, "What's the big deal?" It's, 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 no, it's the, it's the no, guy's no, no. comments. It's not, it's not his comments on the dining room table. He's renting that space to the guy, but he can take it and put it together with the guy's other stuff. It's not Dafka the garbage. There's a whole schmooze about it. Why should it be? In al Rebbe Shechon Aruch, that mashke is a shayla, is it called Chomaz Gomo? Or is it called Zeya? Zeya means uh, it's, 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 like steam, like, like, like vapor. Yeah. And... Uh, I don't remember right now, but there's an issue here between the Maril, the Rebbe's brother, and that he, w I think he was Mako. No, but the question where, here is, even where, if it's, where it's Chomets Gomel, Gomel, where it's Chomets Gomel, where it's Chomets I got to find this. Somewhere. Rabbi, even if it was Chomets Gomer, no, so. it was on the table, it still belonged to the guy. You yeah, sold the Chomets to all the guy. His whole house, yeah, he sold the Chomets in that house. He sold the Chomets in the house, but he didn't remember it. Instead of putting it in a closet, he left it on the table. It's still the guy's comments. Yeah. Is it cutting to you? You say if we, if we find comments to intention, I need to go to burn that. Why you need to burn it? It's not yours. It's belong to the guy. That, if it's huh? one, that's correct. Huh? 
you know? You don't have to. You do. You don't have to. Only. Uh, is that? Once that, a month. That, no, because that, 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 that's you found comments that you didn't have a mind to sell. But, but you we just said if you had a box of about it. But, yeah. he, but when, Rabbi, if you didn't if know you, you had a case sell, of cookies in the basement. If you're selling the house, yes. yeah? Everything if in your house. If, if you found a, under, under a bed a, 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 a cookie, so that you have to burn. Correct, but you, it, because you, you didn't but mind. But why did you burn? If, if you sold it to the guys, it belonged to the guys. You, you didn't sell the. You, you, you sold all the chumas that, that that you want to sell, but this you, you didn't even know about it. Can I want to sell the chumas that I don't know about? No, no. But you're holding. When you say from you have to say chutz from this. How do you physically make it because of that? Why not? Because of that. He said, how are you touching the chametz? He wants to know how you transfer the chametz to the fire. Throw it in. You pick it up with your hands. And you, today everyone has a pair of rubber gloves in their house. Better is not to find it. I once went to a shul, I want to say the name. And we came pace out of a bag of bagels right next to our place. Right. Now that happens plenty of times. And the breakfast that you have the next morning also. You need to clean it. You're not selling that chametz. That's the problem. Say, because you that chametz you don't bring it down. If you don't eat that cereal the next morning, you're in trouble. Because it's understood. And it, it doesn't go into the guy's resource until after you demand. Anyway, what are you worried about? You don't have to write chutz. So you'll have to eat the chametz. It's not his yet. Just automatically, this goes when it's... When it's time, this chametz goes, it goes. No. The shaila is a different shaila. The shaila is if you get up in the morning and you put away chametz, right? And you're going to eat it for the meal. So you know, it wasn't in the mechirah. He didn't have in mind to put it in the mechirah. And then at 11.30, after everything is all done, at 12.30, you walk in and you realize that the box is here that you're going to have for breakfast. That was not in your mechirah because you're going to eat it this morning for breakfast. And now what do you do? That's what you have to burn. But that definitely wasn't in the man. That was a ratzili. You said, I'm going to save this uh, bagel and we eat it in the morning. But if you never ate it, and then it comes after this man, technically you have to go burn that. That's, that's, that would be chavitz if you found. That's not in the stomach. Okay.